Hello friends, hope you are doing well. So uh, in the previous videos we have gone through what is the frame set, how we can use the frame set along with the uh, target uh, attribute. Now in this video we will see how we can use the list box. So for including the, it's, the list box is similar to the uh, select tag. So for uh, the there is a slight changes for the list box. It's similar to uh, the, the drop down options uh, which you have seen. Uh, the only thing is that I have to use the attribute size. So to see that example, uh, let's let's start from the beginning. I include the HTML file, uh, the HTML tag, sorry, then the head tag, then I have the title tag. So I have the title tag. It's uh, the list box example. Okay, I'll close the title. I'll close the head. So within that. I'll have body and uh, I include some uh, form. I'll, I'll give the name suppose F1. Okay, and then I'll close the form. I'll close the form. Then I'll uh, close the body. And then I'll close the HTML. So it's a good programming practice if you give some proper indentation. You can see here this is the HTML head body. This is the form in that uh, I include the form opening and closing tag. And then I have the body. And then I'm closing the HTML. So let me save it in the HTML folder. So this is list box dot HTML. Okay, so right now if I run this page, run lunch in Chrome, nothing is there. You can see. Now let me go to the code within the form. I'll use the tag select. Okay, I'll close the select tag. Fine, and then I'll write the option. I'll into the tag option. So option suppose India. Close the option. Then, so here I'll include some suppose eight three select the country and the list. Okay. Fine. So I'll have some options. So now if I uh, if I go to the browser and press F5, you can see the one drop down option is there. Okay, that is only for India. Select the country from the list. So I have India. So now I'll I'll include one more option. Option. Suppose Japan. Okay. And input. This is opening and closing tag. ये आप लोग देख सकते हो ये select tag है. Select tag के अंदर ये option tag है. Option tag के अंदर मैं data entry कर रहा हूँ. So uh, option. Uh, previously I have shown you option name and sub name. You can write without name attribute also. I have told you to include the in the previous video in well I have shown you the select tag. There I have shown you the name the old name. So this name I can use. For the further uh, operation, so same thing you uh, you can include the name. Uh, in this example, uh, you can include the exam uh, name attribute, or you can remove the name attribute. So right now we don't we don't require the name attribute. You can you can also include the name attribute. So let me include one more option. Yeah, or a option you include for wrong. Suppose you can okay and close the option. I'll include one more option. Close the option. Yeah. Fine, save it. I'll go to the browser. F5. So you can see this is I can select UK, Japan, USA, whatever you want. 
also I can use the selected attribute. So if I refresh, so by default it will select the USA only. Right? These are all I have seen in the uh, example of select tag. So right now, what I'll do, I'll use include one more uh, attribute in the select tag that is size. Size is equal to five. I'll save it. Uh, right now it's uh, it's four, so I'll make it five and include and include one more option. Option suppose this here. Okay. So close the option. Close it. Save it. So you can see select is the track within that I have the various options and here I have given the size. So what will happen now? Let go let go to the browser F5. So here you can see since I have given the size, it will show me all the details and it will show me in this format. So you can see you can select all the details. So suppose if you want if you want the scenario in this manner that uh, if, when I select India, some details is shown in this portion. If I select Japan, it will show some details in this portion. If I select UK, it will show me some details in this portion. If I select USA, it will show some details in this portion and so on for Russia. So that type of uh, things can be done by using the uh, list box. So this is the this is nothing but list box which we will uh, which which is used. So this is the list box and uh, here let me do some dr tag save it that's right okay so select the country from the list so I can select the country fine let me include some center tag okay within the form uh, up on the once the form is closed I'll close the center tag save it that's right uh, I'll use all tab and then in the browser and press F5. Press in the center. Let me input some background color that is BG color. It was light blue. So we go to browser F5. So this light blue. So like this, I can include some. Suppose if I select three, okay, and then go to the browser and then F5. You can see I have this drop down option. I can use this uh, scroll bar. Okay, so since I have given size three, so it will show me the first three size, and the remaining uh, options I need to uh, scroll the details. Same thing for suppose if I give two, save, control plus S, then all tab, and then F5. So right now by default it will show me two options. Now then to see the remaining I need to scroll down. So this options is available in the uh, in the select tag. In the select tag whatever size you will give it will show me that details. So uh, like this I can use. So let me give three. Let me include few options. Let me include few options. Suppose option. Hmm. Okay, and save. So let me uh, okay. So I have I have used the uh, select so size is equal to three, and I have this options. Uh, I have total one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight options. So right now, if I go to the browser and press F5, you can see 
only three options it will show me now if i scroll down i can see all the details only if i change the size if i remove the size it will use the select tag it will come in the drop down option it will come in the drop down option fine it will come in the drop down option if i use the select tag okay here also i can select if i don't input any attributes in the select tag so aap log dekh sakte ho yahan pe maine attribute use kiya hai size select tag ke sath to jaise hi main size uh, attribute ko hata diya hu to ye normal select tag jo hum log dekhe the previous video mein waise hi ho raha hai but main yahan pe jab main size use kar raha hu to wo sare details drop down option mein show kar raha hai one by one so this is possible by using the attribute size so this is the beauty of size attribute in the select tag so like that i can include all, all other options and basically this type of uh, list box is basically used to to, to do the various examples suppose uh, when i uh, just think about scenario you have the various items so if i select on this uh, suppose some items it will show some message or it will show some the picture of that item suppose if i select uh, the country japan it will show me the map of the japan along with the places to be visited so like that you can uh, do some project so if i select uk it will show me the image the the map of the image along with the places to visit so like that i can use uh, this uh, drop down option like uh, list box so i hope uh, i have cleared the concept with the list box if you have any doubt uh, don't forget to comment in this video for more subscribe the channel uh, take care Stay tuned. Bye.